guys, and welcome back to Need for Speed Unbound. Today, we've got the Dodge Charger Hellcat. This probably isn't what you were expecting, and to be honest, it wasn't exactly what I was expecting. We're in the final week of the campaign. We're about to take on the Grand, and we need a good S-plus class car. Where is this thing at? Right here. So, um, we have our GTR from last episode. Really, really good, but to be honest, not quite good enough. I want something that's right at the very, very tippity top of S-plus class, and we couldn't quite get it there. But I think we're going to be able to do that with this. So take a look at the company this thing keeps. It's an S-Class 282, top speed 204, 0 to 60 and 3.6, but at $145,500. The ones around it, 161, 255, 156, 220, 180, 547, 180. Not like, this thing is cheap when you compare it to some of the options around its same skill level. So uh, we're going to see... If we can upgrade this thing and um, really just kind of turn it into a monster. A 6.4 liter V8 with 707 brake horsepower can upgrade it up to 1099. That's what we're going to be looking to do here. So I think we're going to go through and we're just going to completely max this thing out. I hope that we have enough money to be able to do so. That was the other thing. Like we, we need something that could be better than the gtr and we also needed to be able to afford it oh it's it's already getting a little bit sketchy we might have to have to build this thing throughout the course of this episode we're down to ninety four thousand dollars, 35 on our exhaust system here i'm just going with anything and everything we can we're going to try to put that root supercharger in there this is fifty four thousand dollars and we have uh We've pretty much run out of money here. So I do know what uh, look I want to go for. We can't afford a, um, a a body kit at this point in time, but I definitely want to go for a uh, a matte, like a gunmetal gray almost, something like that. No, no uh, color shift here. We could do a metallic matte. We could do a fine metal flake matte. There's a lot of carbon and stuff. Ooh, the honeycomb carbon. That's pretty cool. Fine metal flake matte gray dude we can't even enter half of these events because we don't have the buy-in money okay I, di I didn't really think this through we're we're gonna have to grind for some money here what a drift event zero dollar buy-in for a 40k dub it's not gonna get better than that let's go do that this thing kind of tends to to Yo, side on the drift side of things too which is nice any word from jasmine she called to warn me about what the cops were up to it was a weird first phone call after two years she called you What's her deal? Honestly, who knows what the ass? I really thought I knew her, Rad, though. Listen, don't be so hard on yourself. What kind of life is a life without trust? A life without a safety net? A life without hope? Are you reading that from your book? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this book has changed my life. <laughs> okay, Rad, though. I'll catch you back at the garage. Remember that book? It was like, how to not be sad or something like that. We saw it in the very first episode. He's He's been doing his reading. That's good. What's our projected here is third place. I'm going to go for it, baby. I'm in. I'm going to bet 5,500 that we're going to be able to be ASAP. And I don't even have... Yeah, I was going to say I don't even have that kind of cash. All right, we're, we're going to go for, for that. Second place. Got to beat uh, 197, 546, but obviously 222 is going to be the biggest thing for us here. The good news is, is these are... Ooh, it's raining too. I feel like these are... Uh, some of these showcase events and drift events and things. You can kind of take them at your own pace. You can cheese it a little bit if you have to. You just got to make sure that you're keeping that multiplier going up the entire time. And we're, we're going to be able to make, make this thing work for us. It's going to be a work in progress. And the other thing I didn't even think about is that we're going to need $200,000 by the end of the week for our buy-in for the grand. Now, the, the thing is, is we have done... Um, we've done some pink slip races over the course of these episodes. We've won, like, I think we've got an Alfa Romeo. We've got a few other things. So, if worse comes to worse, we're just going to be able to sell some vehicles. But I'd like to be able to keep all of our vehicles if we can. And sell the vehicles that we won. Like, I, I wouldn't sell, like, our GTR and stuff. But, like, the things that are just sitting on our inventory right now. The problem is, is you sell them at a loss. Like, if you want to buy them back, you're going to end up paying nearly double. So, got to kind of be a little bit careful about that. But you see what I mean? Like, we could, we could go slow. We can get a, a little bit extra out of every corner. And let's hope that we can get up to five times multiplier and catch these guys. This is the longest drift event I have ever taken place in. Oh my goodness, dude. I wish we would have... I mean, we could have known. 
We wouldn't have had the money to buy them anyway. I was going to say, I wish we could have thrown some drip tires on before this. These tires are fairly sticky, but I really like the way this thing is, is vibing. Uh, I've, it's fairly easy to get loose in the corners, even with, you know, not a, a ton of horsepower and stuff. I mean, it's got a decent amount of stock, but we have one more lap here. We're already at 128 halfway through. We should be able to get this no problem, I would think, especially because we're starting lap two with a five times multiplier. But yeah, I think, uh, I think drift leaning cars in this game are better, even for normal races. Just because you can get them loose in the corners. Come on, baby. We're getting there. Up to second place. Love to see it. Woo. Almost lo lost our 5X there. The good news is you could just hit a, a little thing of nitrous, and that actually keeps your, uh, your multiplier for some of the long sections where you can't keep drifting. Dude, we're 20... A little over 22,000 away. And there it is, baby. Let's go. We got a first place. That's 40K in the bank plus our bet. Now, the thing is, is we don't have a lot of ground to stand on here. Like, I, I don't want to risk too much, but I do think that's going to put us in a spot we're going to be able to take on any other race. I mean, 48K here to $24,000 profit. It's a head-to-head -head 1v1. We've got... Um, $12,000 profit here, $16,000 profit here. I think we got to go for both of those. If we can get both of those, that's going to get us close to the point where we're just going to be able to build this thing out how we want it. We're not going to have to worry about Holden loves selling lecture. anything. Because he was born and raised here. I really don't want to sell like anything. You, his father's secretary took him for hot fudge sundays and cream drinks. His nanny took him for cream drinks? He for a hot fudge lecture. sunday? And he'll do anything to keep it safe. I'm Holden Parker III, and I'm the safe choice. Our enemies have tons of resources, and they're smart. So am I. They never stop thinking about new ways to harm Lakeshore and her people. So, neither do I. Paid for by Who's Your Caddy, Lakeshore's premier golf in paradise. We'll put a strut in your putt. Swing by now, east of I-97, by the sewage treatment Bro, the, the radio... Don't know who's worse. Parker Stevenson. And how many sponsors has this guy got? The radio stations in this game are incredibly sus, bro. I'm going to Cream Dreams, and then I'm going to go to the golf course right next to the sewage plant. All right. Let's go make some more money. Couple races. And we're going to be able to fit this thing out right. I mean, we're kind of in a, a must-win situation. Right now, our GTR is better. I think, I think I'm going to take the GTR here. Sorry, Mr. Charger. It's, I, I, I'm not upset about seeing this thing again. This is my pride and joy. Thing looks like a fighter jet. Look how wide and ridiculous this thing is. See ya. Girl, I'm about to take you to Cream Dreams after I beat you on this date and take your money. All right, <clears throat> Trev, let's not get out of pocket here. Let's win this race. Make a, you know, nice little five-figure payday. I think there's one more five-figure after this, and then we're going to try to get it back to the garage and see if we can't finish this build. She's on us, dude. I hope you don't mind losing money. Woo! We're good. I definitely, I mean, to be honest... <laughs> Granted, it's slower, so it's going to feel more controlled. I do like the way the, the Charger turns more than this GTR. GTR is just a little bit too sticky. Oh, she went way off the road back there. Okay. Oh, she's she's done. That's that's a double. She got stuck on something back there. Straight to the finish here, dude. The way that the nitrous... Okay. Let's make sure we stay on the road here, Trev. The way the nitrous comes out of, like, the bull horns on the front of the car is just so... Ridiculous. That was a flawless race there. It's money in the bank, baby. That's what I'm talking about. 25,750. It is gonna increase our, our heat a little bit. I honestly feel like maybe we should stick in the GTR for right now, especially because we have those jammer abilities and stuff as well. So this is gonna be a um ooh, a twenty-six thousand dollar. Okay. I'm down for that. Let's go for it. We're gonna make over a hundred K just in this one session. Pull into the meetup. Ugh. 
you imagine you saw one of these at a car meet? I mean, it's it's kind of ugly. Like you 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 can't say that it's not ugly. I'm I'm betting full full max amount. Give me the extra 4750. We're beating ASAP this time around. He gave us some problems in the last episode. I don't take to that kindly. Dude, he's hyped. All right, here we go. We got to beat him. Let's get it. Woo! Perfect start. <laughs> Is he a vegan? I didn't know that. All right, up to a, a P3 to start. Real money is getting first place. Beating him is just kind of a little cherry on top. So, of course, this is going to be a race that is not perfectly suited for this car, but it's it's okay. We're going to work work through it. Honestly, this would have been better for the Charger. It just wouldn't have been fast enough. They're driving so crazy, they're slamming into each other. Rub it is racing, Mr. Police Officer. I don't know why you're talking to me. No cops are on us, but we got cops coming over the radio. First place is gone, Shimzu. Only 6K between us and first. That's all right. Ew. Just take a cop out. Why not? We're going to be able to catch him here. Oh, 56% of the way through the race. All right. We don't have much time. We're close to him. Dude, every band matters, baby. Every band matters. Come on. Oh, 20%. We're right on him. Grab that draft. Grab that draft. Grab that draft. Oh, my God. I don't think we're going to be able to get him. Mm. This is why we need that charger, dude. Once we have enough money to fully upgrade it, it's not going to be an issue. We're going to be fast enough. I, I think the GTR is just losing a little bit on speed. We're going to be okay. 26,750. We'll take it. So we had another drift event. It was an A-class drift event, which is a little weird. Um, back here in the Eclipse that we got right at the very start of the game, we are now up to a five-star heat level. We've got $121,000. And we are back to the garage. Let's go, baby. All right, go ahead and lock that in. We'll take it. That was one of our best days ever. And uh, hopefully, we're going to have enough money to be able to complete this build here. So performance is the biggest part for us. We're gonna keep going through and doing max on everything. I feel like nitrous is maybe the easiest thing for us to skip. Let me see here. We're gonna go for a um, an elite road suspension for 17,500. We're gonna go for some elite brakes for 27,000. Dude, this is getting so expensive. Do we have, we've got pro tires. I'm gonna go for some elite tires here. Do we want road? Do we want Drift, grip. I think I'm going to go road. Elite road tires. Sounds good to me. So we've got those. Drive train. Oh my goodness, dude. A new clutch is going to be 42,500. Wow. Okay. This is, we're going to need even more money. I really want to complete this build in this episode. So I, I think I'm going to have to go out. I'm just going to grind. I'm just going to use our GTR. I'm going to grind. I'm going to get us some money. Hopefully we have some, some high money races here. 40K. I mean, one, one good night should get us most of the way there. This is crazy, but it's going to be worth it. So we had a hot night. It was good. $178,000. That is by far the most we've ever done. I'm not going to lie. I was scared quite a bit of the time. It was a few races. There was, a, I think, an $80,000 race and then a, a $40,000 um, Yaz car delivery. So, um, it was okay. I mean, we were in the GTR, same thing. I want to focus on the charger for this episode. So, uh, should be able to fully, you know, kind of trick this thing out, both performance and visually. Now I do, I, I almost feel like this, this is more of a matte black, isn't it? I want to go more gray. Got to bring the brightness up a little bit. Yeah. Something, something like that. That is more of what I was looking for there. Go ahead and save that over our last one. Like, it, it's kind of black, and at nighttime, it's probably going to look black. But during the daytime, you've just got a little brightness to it. That looks good. So, uh, performance. We should be able to max everything, right? I'm going max on the nitrous, 42,500. I mean, technically, this is the vehicle that we're probably going to end up winning the grand in. So, uh, we want to make sure that everything is good to go. We've got max on that. An elite differential for $20,000. Beautiful. And that's going to take us up. To a ridiculous, ridiculous power amount. 1,181 horsepower at the wheels. We've got perfect ultimate parts across the board. We could put some aux parts in there. I'm going to say, especially because we run into so many issues, 
I'm going to go Undercover Racer for $32,000. And then I'm thinking maybe... Hmm... Increase nitrous earning from draft near miss turns drifting. I'm going to say drifting. I feel like drift nitrous is probably our, our best thing there. Okay. I mean, this thing's maxed out. It, it doesn't get any better than this. This is the top of the S class. Now let's take a look at our, uh, at our, our style here. First and foremost, we're going to take a look at the body kit. So this is stock. This is the carbon body kit. Okay. Oh, look at the, the rear canards there. We've got the louvers on the rear window. Kind of aggressive, wide body fenders. I don't know if I love those. I like them when they're a little bit more swoopy. Next one is this carbon one. Oh, they're all from carbon, really? So this one's black and red. We got a bumper delete on the rear. Ooh, a, a transparent ducktail spoiler. I actually really like that. And then we've got this one here. Ooh, <laughs> dude, this looks like something out of like Cyberpunk 2077. That's pretty nasty. What do we think? I mean, this one's a little bit more tame, but I, I kind of feel like we go for this one just to go all out. $39,900. Send it. We have almost blown through all of our money again. We're going to have to earn 200 k by the end of this thing. So um, definitely going to want... Um, I'm going to say headlights. Can we... We can smoke the headlights. I don't think you would want to, though. Maybe, maybe a little bit. Just to, nah, I actually, I, I feel like standing out and having the LEDs there is, is what makes it really interesting. Hood and everything are good. I'm going to say the spoiler. Do we want to change the spoiler at all? I actually kind of like what we were working with where only thing I would do is go for the translucent one, but or transparent one, but I, I feel like this one's sick. Okay. I, I feel like, I feel like we aren't going to be able to improve this much. The bad cat, baby. All right. Ooh, with the red view county. Uh, plate there looks pretty good. We can, can we change, we can change the exhaust tips. That's something that we haven't done much of. I don't know if I love a lot of them though. Maybe something like this. Oh, that's the stock ones. Okay. Definitely gonna, gonna darken out the, uh, the taillights. I do kind of like the rims on here. So I, I don't know if we're going to be able to find much that I would prefer more. If anything, I would think something with like a little bit of a dish, like a muscle car to it. But I also like, dude, we we kind of need to save some of our money. I mean, I think I'm going to leave the stock rims on there. I'm happy with the rims. Oh my goodness, dude. Will we put the wrap back on there? This thing is disgusting. I kind of want to put some tints on there. But I also feel like maybe not necessary. Do we like the red license plate or should we black that out too? We could have just straight white. We could have kind of like a ooh darker with the neon. Ooh, the blue is kind of nasty too. I mean, we are going to have some red in there. Oh, you can get every state. I didn't know that. Dude, I love the Bayview one. I remember that from the last game. Texas. A Texas bad cat plate. And of course, last but not least, we're going to put some $5,000 red underglow on there to match our calipers. This is one of the sickest things I have seen in my entire life. $60,000 S plus class race. Don't mind if I do. Let's do it. Here we go. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of this one. Oh my goodness. It looks so much better on the road. Hey kid. I kind of like that we fishbowled it too. Hit me up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you heard any more from Yaz? We spoke last night. Is she good? We'll see. We're working some angles. Let's see where it goes. Angles? Relax. We know what we're doing. I don't want you to go and... Rydell, you gotta trust us, okay? I know it's hard, but this is for the best. For all of us. All right, all right, all right. You're not kids anymore. I'm not sure we ever were, boss. This thing has so much power. It just feels like I'm out of the loop sometimes. That's on me. Look, everything you've done for me means a lot. I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. Maybe I don't tell you that enough. Okay, I hear you. Later, kid. That's a heartfelt moment. He's got a job for us, too, to be able to make some money. I cannot believe how sick this thing looks. Let me, let me hop outside here. This is... Out. Honestly, I almost feel like the headlights are a bit much. If I was going to change anything, that might be it. But apart from that, this thing is perfect. This is almost like a drag spoiler back here. 1,200 horsepower. I don't even want to know how much money we put on this thing. But uh, this has to be one of the fastest cars in the game.
straight out of Cyberpunk 2077, 100%. That, that front LED bar. I mean, it's cool because it's different. We're going to have to see it at night, but I think we're going to have to wait to do that until the, um, the what's it called? The, the Grand. We'll see it there. Look at that. Projected to finish ahead of Rocky. Oh, my goodness. This thing is disgusting. Dude, I love the customization in this game. Even the body kits that aren't like the, the big boys, like the legendary ones. They're so sick. No money for you to be getting ASAP. It's all mine, baby. We in the big body. <laughs> Dude, we could just push people around. This thing is thick, boy. Okay, a lot of torque. A lot of torque. A lot of power going to the wheels. We're going to have to get used to it. Remember on our drifts, we're going to be earning more nitrous. I almost thought about drafting, but I feel like drifting is going to be kind of the um, specialty of this thing. And this is a bad race for it, but a lot of races, you just have a lot of drifting around corners and things. Look how easy she is to get loose. Somebody wrecked out in front of us there, 33 or 30% of the way through this race, about a third. Going left here. I'm gonna follow Lyric. Staying on the left side of the road. Come on, baby. Oh my goodness, Trev. What just that's my bad. That's my bad. We actually had a pretty good spawn there. So I was so focused on drafting him and trying to... I was, like, looking down at our nitrous. I didn't... He, like, moved out of the way, and there was a, a car there coming at us. I just wasn't ready for it. That's my fault. That was a big wreck, dude. That was a very big wreck. Honestly, we're okay, though. I don't really intend to spend any more money. We've got a couple nights until the Grands. I'm just going to... Uh, this thing sounds so nasty with the gargles and rumbles happening. I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna grind it out. Next. Next episode is, is gonna be, I think, the finale, I would assume. We'll see how the finale works and how long it takes and that sort of thing. But, um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna, gonna do a few races and we're gonna be pretty much good to go. 71% of the way here, we made our way back. This thing is so sketch, dude. It's so fast. We gotta keep in mind that's part of the problem is we're just starting to go way faster, so the mistakes are gonna they're gonna happen. Especially with drifting at these speeds. This drive is a complete numbskull. Better buckle up. I can do this with my eyes closed. Holy cow, alright. I mean it's it's fast, but we gotta learn how to tame it. We gotta gotta wrangle in this kitty, baby. This, it almost feels like a little bit too much power, if I'm being honest. We, I'm, I'm, I'm going to mess around with it. We might be a little bit too far on drift, and I think we might want to add a little bit more drift. Give me just 10 more yards there, and we could have made it. That's all right. We'll take a P3. Still going to make a decent amount of money. Still be ASAP, so we're okay. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. Like I said, I think we're going to be taking on the Grands. So we'll see what happens with Alec and with... Yaz and Tess and everyone. It's going to be a great time, and I'll see you guys there. Peace out. Oh, wait for it. We've got very little fight left in us, folks. We cleared... <laughs> Bro, we cleared the roadside. This thing is ridiculous. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.